What is up, Star Wars fans? This is Darth Watson, and in this video, we're going to be talking about James Mangold's Star Wars movie, and what to expect with James Mangold's Star Wars movie, as well as some rumors going on about James Mangold's Star Wars movie. So there's a rumor going on about James Mangold's Star Wars movie. We'll start with the rumor, but the rumor going on about James Mangold's Star Wars movie is going to be is going to be going into into production sometime before the the Charmino Bay Chinoy Star Wars movie and that could push back the Ray Star Wars movie which I think that's Disney and Lucasfilm's best interest for right now to push back the Ray Star Wars movie to come out last after James Mangold Star Wars movie after Dave Filoni Star Wars movie after the Mandalorian and Grogu to have it come out after all of those films and right now it's too early to see any more Star Wars projects around the sequel era with Rey and Finn especially when it comes to Star Wars movies and if they want the Charmino Bay Chinoy Star Wars movie to be successful to be much better than the sequel trilogy then this film is going to need a lot of work. Now, I'm not saying this film is not possible, and I'm not going to be spreading a rumor that this film is canceled, or it's not going to happen, or it's never going to happen with Charmino Bay Chinoy Star Wars movie. It is possible to have another sequel era film that takes place after The Rise of Skywalker, but they have to do it properly, and, and this, film, this film needs a lot more work than what Lucasfilm and Disney initially thought for this film and Stephen Knight just recently walked off which I recently heard about this where Stephen Knight had four different versions of the script Kathleen Kennedy didn't like either one of them and I know Kathleen Kennedy is pushing for the star for the Ray Star Wars movie to come out uh, as the first Star Wars film, but it's just not very realistic right now, and I think it's more realistic for the Charmino Bay Chinoy Star Wars film to be delayed for a few years, is the way I'm looking at it, and I think that's more realistic that way, and it needs years of development. It needs a lot more time of development. If they want this film to be better than the sequel trilogy, to have a better film that every Star Wars fan can come see once again. It needs to be worked on a lot and it needs a lot more work than just a few years of work. But anyways, uh, James Mangold Star Wars movie, the rumor for James Mangold Star Wars movie is that it might go into production before the Rey Star Wars movie, which that which, which I can see possibly happening, and I think we need to focus on these Star Wars films first. The Mandalorian and Grogu, Dave Filoni Star Wars movie, James Mangold Star Wars movie, and possibly other Mandoverse Star Wars movies that could be coming as well. And we should see uh, also a movie about Obi-Wan Kenobi. We should also see some stories that take place between episodes one and two maybe they should do a star wars movie based on anakin skywalker's jedi training but as far as the charmino bay chinoy star wars movie being be, being trying to be the first star wars movie to come out it's just not realistic but anyways like with the with the james mangled star wars movie it's going to be about the beginning of time for star wars 25,000 years before the events of episode 1, telling the dawn of the Jedi, the story of the first Jedi, how the galaxy formed, and it's going to be a very different type of Star Wars film, but during the beginning of time for the Star Wars universe, kind of like a biblical aspect or something like that, the way, the way we could look at it, the way Christians could look at it, like telling like, telling like the beginning of time in Star Wars, but we can apply it to like like the beginning of time within the Bible and stuff like that. But anyways, that's all I have to say for this video. Do make sure to smash a like, subscribe, comment, and I will catch you all later in another video.